everyone. I'm Angelo Piga, Product Manager for RTS PartyLine. In this video, we are going to demonstrate connecting and configuring DBP Digital Belt Pack and OMS Omnio Main Station. First, let's look at all the items needed to install an RTS Digital PartyLine system. We have a DBP, an OMS, a PoE Power Over Ethernet switch, and an LH300 headset. We have three versions of OMS that support Digital Belt Pack. We have OMS Digital Basic, OMS Intermediate, and OMS Advanced. To connect DBP to OMS, you will need a PoE switch that runs on 802.3 AF or 802.3 AT standards. For Ethernet cables, we recommend using Cat5e cable or better with a 13 ohm or less resistance. DBP connects to OMS using Omnio IP technology for media transport and control data. Technologies such as Dante and AES70 are fully supported within Omnio. Let's get started on connecting our devices. On the back of the OMS, you will find the RJ45 Omnio connectors labeled J11. Connect an Ethernet cable from one of the two Omnio ports to a port on your PoE switch. Then, from a second port on the PoE switch, connect an Ethernet cable to the PoE in on the DBP. Power from the switch will light up the display on the DBP. After the startup RTS screen, the display will show a disconnect message and no connection on the DBP if it is not configured. The OMS can quickly search to find the DBP on the network using the Connect Devices function. Press Menu on the keypad, then navigate to the Configuration icon and select. Selections can be made either with the Select key or by pushing the Encoder 2 knob. Select the Ports icon, then navigate to the Connect Devices icon and select. OMS scans for available Omnio devices and then shows devices that support Easy Connect. Discoverable devices need to be powered on, connected to the network, and be on the same subnet. I want to reiterate the OMS and the DBP have to be on the same subnet or the DBP will not be found within Connect devices. On the Connect Devices menu, navigate to the Connect All button or you can navigate to the Omnio device if it appears on the screen. Navigate to the Connect button, click the Encoder 2 knob, and then the Omnio devices or the selected Omnio device connects to the OMS. With Easy Connect, OMS will automatically assign the first four party lines to channels A, B, C, and D on the DBP. As easy as that, you will now be able to communicate between the OMS and the DBP. If you need to change offers or key assignments on the DBP, it can be easily done within the DBP menu. Navigate to the DBP Offers menu by selecting Setup, Offers, DBP Offers. Press the Select button and the field becomes active. Rotate either Master Volume Control knob to scroll through the available offers. Press the Select button to confirm the change. Now I will show you how to update key assignments on the belt pack. Navigate to Key Assignments menu by selecting Setup and Key Assignments. Rotate the Master Volume Control knob to navigate to the desired talk key and press the Select button. The talk key button turns red and the display shows the talk keys as scrollable. Rotate either Master Volume Control to scroll through the available assignments and press the select button to confirm the selection. The last function that I want to show you is volume controls on the belt pack. From the main screen, click either encoder. The master volume activates. Click the AC encoder once for key A and twice for key C to control the volumes on those channels. The listen volume adjustment for the key activates and a volume bar appears on the key. Clicking the encoder will continue the sequence between master and A and C 
channel volumes. Holding the encoder when the volume bar appears on the key will mute and unmute the channel on the DBP. The BD encoder operates the same way for channels B and D. This concludes connecting and configuring our DBP digital belt pack and OMS Omnio main station. Thanks for watching. For further information, please visit rtsintercoms.com. If you need to contact us for sales, support, or service, visit our contacts page and you can email or call your local RTS service representative. Thank you.